Welcome back to Storage Chasers and part two of the uh, printer unit. That was in the first part. <laughs> this is all, all these boxes here are the second part. Yay. If you missed the first part, go back and watch it. Uh, and find out why we actually bid on this unit and got bid up on it. <laughs> but uh, this is some keeper stuff and keeper stuff that we already went through. But we have these boxes here. Miscellaneous stuff we'll have to go through right now and uh, see what's in there. All right, kicking it off. We've got some wires. Looks like an old uh, VTEC phone system. There's some uh, some speakers. Here's a Wii thingy. Um, yeah, we found some other Wii parts. In uh, video one, here's another. Oh, that's Xbox. It's not Wii, is it? No. Sorry, I'm not up on my computery gaming thingies like I probably should be, but I'm too old for that kind of garbage. So, wires and stuff. Open the wires and stuff box. <laughs> this box is falling apart already, so that's a good sign. Uh, no, it's not. All right. What do we got? We got a bunch of, bunch of burnt CDs, looks like. Yeah, C-clamp, that'll be a good keeper item. Ho, 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 anything in the Christmas car for me? Oh, yo, yo, yo. And nothing in there. And this looks like some books, school books, more stuff, GED test book. Uh, maybe we could sell that one online. Uh, what is this? Looks like another textbook. Uh, T.D. Jake's book. It's a good book. Some of the stuff. Just, yeah. We end up getting a lot more trash than treasure in these kind of boxes. But we will look through here and see what's in here. And uh, filter through a little closer so that you guys can see it. Some kind of a Toshiba hard drive. Must be from like a laptop or something, huh? All right, we'll look into that. Oh, we got a phone. We dumb stuck to it. All right, that'll go in the uh, keeper box here. Ooh, it's one of them stretchy things. Bling, bling, bling. Okay. Um, yeah, one of those. The card, uh, power card for Game Busters. We find several of those. Tool, we keep tools. Um, yeah. Miscellaneous hanger parts. Some of the stuff sells at the flea market and uh, some not. But we do like getting cash. Cash. Save the cash. Right. I'm not really seeing too much more in this particular one. How business works. It's a textbooky. So, yeah. We got those that we'll uh, look through better. But uh, for now, let's all this off to the side. We got lots of boxes to go through. Uh, We've got light bulb box. Let's see if that fits in here. And uh, yeah, it's a light bulb in there. Supposed to be two, I see one. Uh, yeah, we'll uh, see what we can do with that. This, I believe, is trash from the unit. This, uh, some kind of material, maybe a curtain or maybe a cover for one of the printers. So we'll probably have to look at that. There's a shoe. One. One shoe to save the world. Put that over there. Next box. Oh, garbage. Um, more safety glasses. I don't like three pairs of those. They must have been really safe people. And then uh, here's a watch. Yeah, we'll keep a watch. Keep a watch for something. All right, we got junk and junk. We got some pins. And more box CDs. And all of our paperwork and trash and trash and trash. And it looks like another phone. Ugh. Yeah, the old uh, Motorola flip phone. But uh, yeah, that's going to be more tr more stuff we have to do later. Uh, this box here is an AT&T thingy. And it's uh, got an AT&T thingy in it. Kind of brand new-ish in the box. Some kind of U-verse, I guess it's a modem, 
or router or one of them so yeah i will look that up online and uh see if we can make some money on that one let me open this box it's easy to see in there all right we got a calculator maybe got another phone it's broken phone case this means nothing another td jake's book keep those looks like books books license plate frame open toothbrush Ew, junk mail, junk mail, junk mail. A couple other books that we'll have to go for. More TD Jakes. Good inspirational speaker guy. If you've never read any of his stuff or heard him speak, very intelligent Christian guy. All right. Uh, nope, nope. Some journals. Books, books. Box. And yeah, let's see what's in the mystery box. And not what I thought. Okay, winner's circle, get money back. Some pills and some, probably some fake jewelry. Nothing looks realistic to me. Well, maybe these bows here. This bow kind of does. This could be a gold piece here. And there's a penny. We always do like our pennies. So that's always good. We'll go through that in greater detail. Got a pair of uh, fake glasses here, NYGs. I'll just throw them in the box here and we'll figure that out later too. All right, next box. Next box is, says it's an office jet. I'm pretty sure it ain't. <laughs> but we'll go in there and see. And uh, I was more correct than you. All right, what do we got? We got a bag of... Uh, Wires and wires and uh, more of their junk mail. Got envelopes. Professional stethoscope. And it's brand new in the box. Ish. So, could sell. And looks like more wires and wires. There's a hat. It's a gold hat. It says Make America Great Again. It's seen better days, but so is our country. Hopefully it'll get back to it again one day. Um, I think I see another Wii controller in here. There's another Wii controller thing. So there's got to be a Wii pieces parts in here. See another modem in there. All right, wires. Get in there. What else we got? We got a purse. The makeup bag. It's got a makeup bag with makeup stuff in it. Ooh, I like that one. I like what that looks like right there. This is Louis Vuitton. Let's open this bag. Let's open it up real quick, y'all. And see. Um, could it be an actual Louis? Mm -hmm. If it is, it's uh, seen better days. But there's the check part. This is really good from something else. Does not have any markings on that part. Ooh. we'll go through the wallet and see if there's any gift cards or anything like that but for now not so much everything else in here is uh there's some wristbands for some party bring a, invite people for the party and uh, some paperwork 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 uh nothing exciting in there nope nope gamer informer more office supplies. Ooh. Right. Another little, little purse with uh, uh, women-y accoutrement. And uh, there's a mole book. Malaire, something. What else we got in here? What have we got in the box? Oh, we got another bag or something. Uh, here's another jewelry-ish box. It's got some costume jewelry in there. Some more books. More books, more books, personal pictures and books, and books and books and books and books and books, and another bag of trash mail. Sometimes that's where you find the good stuff, people, but we got a, too many bags to go through. Here's another thing here, another wire, I mean, sorry, another thing, uh, yeah. Junk mail. I see a Michael Kors little wallaby there inside here, but everything else looks like 
It's a load of trash. Let me open this up though. I think I see something. Nope, big case. I just want to make sure that you see all the good and the bad. And this is all bad. It's all paperwork and trash. We'll have to go through later. Ooh. We'll go through all this stuff later. So if you want to put down. There we go. Anyway. Next box. We'll go through. Oh, this one should be easy. Uh, here's a roll of stickery paper for the printer. Label detail stuff. Here is a booklet for one of them. Oh, it's got the little diskette for it too. This is for one of the printers. We definitely need to keep that. And uh, then we got a box of little uh, little cups. Little uh, we don't have the lid. These are little little bowls like salsa cups. So maybe you know what I mean. Maybe you don't. But uh, yeah. These are just the, just the little cups. There ain't no lids. How can I keep my salsa if I don't have no lids? Next box. Moving right along. Looks like trash and that is trash and trash. And CDs and CDs. These are all burnt CDs, but I have to check them to see if there's any that go to the Printers, any printer programs, any printer stuff that could be helpful in selling the printers. Did I say that I have some printers for sale? I do. I have really large printers for sale. And once I figure out more about them, yeah. uh, not much fun. Uh, the last of these bigger boxes. Let's get a box of junk junk here. Let's check it out. We got, we got more notepads, more CDs, 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 more toothbrushes and junk, some Advil, I'm going to need that after this unit, uh, here's another book, oops, owner's manual for a fusion, and uh, yeah, and more junk mail, more junk mail, more junk mail, more junk mail, and a uh, little prayer book, okay, that might be something good, ethernet cable that probably goes for something higher warranty more wires and cables and such they go in the wire and cable box for now this one i think goes with whatever came in this box which is a ob1 kenobi something or a ub so whatever a ub is i think this this cable came with that so we'll try to find a ub and uh, what else in the box here? All right, we got some skewers. Got some uh, ten assorted bamboo skewers, almost new. Uh, here's a. Oh, I thought it was a wee thing. Nope, this is some kind of green rhythm rewind orange sleep Accutech. I don't know, some kind of using an adjustable bed, something. <laughs> All right, here's some more cables and wires. And cables and wires and such and there's a couple tool, little tools there's a, one of them there's another thingy this goes to the uh, that goes to a Wii if I can find the end of it anyway put that off to the side and then there's mail and then there's mail and there's some keys yeah, a whole bunch of, a whole bunch of nothingness in there. Yeah, wires and wires and wires. All right, so I do need that one. My wife keeps breaking hers. So we got that. Uh, here's a blue bag. Looks like it's got something in it. Some kind of little little pewter thing in here. Says it's a think pad it looks like it's complete ish so power on where's the power button who got the power who got the power button uh, Lenovo it's a Lenovo think pad uh, maybe I just don't see a button to turn it on maybe it's just me or maybe it's not maybe that one there 
Yeah, it looks like an on and off button. Um, 11E Chromebook, that's what it says. So it's a Lenovo, yeah. So, we got one of them in here with some uh, love notes and stuff. So, yeah, we'll go through all that stuff. And this one is still taped shut. You know we haven't been in it, it's still taped shut. I do like it because what it says on top, I gotta see what's in there. It looks like a laptop. And that's what she would be. She would be a laptop. With Toshiba, the missing buttons. Always missing buttons on nice laptops when you find them. Why is that? People just like break them off or something? Man. All right, more CDs, more weird uh, connector clamps. This probably goes to something. What does it say? It says budget mannequin holder. Well, we didn't get a mannequin, so let's stick that somewhere else. Uh, here's some CD sleeves, so they were doing their own CDs. I'm going to keep all these CD boxes because I'm going to put, I have games that I keep getting. Or, you know, video games that I get. And uh, I got to put them in something. I'll put them in those. Uh, and we got this roll of gray stuff. <laughs> no idea. Uh, we got this compact uh, desktop Passario computer thing. I'm hoping that this went with the monitor from video part one and that this somehow has stuff in it that will control the printers or something. Then we got an extension cord and we got a box that looks kind of empty-ish except for hey, it looks like it's got a keyboard in it. We got the e-machine keyboard even though this is not an e-machine but it's got an e-machine keyboard and uh, then we got some keys and stuff in here. That is it. You have seen it all. All the junk, all the trash, all the treasure. So, whew, thanks for watching part two of this video. That is it. We are done with this unit. Whew, hopefully you enjoyed it. We uh, kind of enjoyed it. Oh, let me uh, say one more thing. Pa pow Yes, we got this in this unit. This humongous uh, Academy Sports Center pop-up. Uh, it's not in bad shape. Uh, it's not blood on here. It's like orange sticker or something that they had on there. Uh, the only thing I can see is this bar up here wants to kind of buckle out, but I'm uh, fairly confident that I can maybe either tighten it up or straighten it out or something. But uh, yeah, this is pretty pretty nice, and uh, it'll still go up one more higher than it is, and it's already at uh, six and a half feet right now. So that's a really good height to one. And uh, just has a few holes in it, <laughs> which is fine. As long as it keeps the sun off of you when we're at the flea markets or something, then uh, that's a good thing. And this is uh, pretty big. Uh, not too thrilled with the, you know, angled stance or slant legs style that this is. But hey, free is free. And uh, if we have to sell it, we will, but we normally just keep all these things because of the condition that they're in and we do use them all the time uh we still do have two more units still we have two units in the trailer we have not gotten to yet because the weather has not permitted us to get the stuff out there's uh, some couches some appliances and other stuff in there in these units and we just can't get them out and uh cover them up like we do here uh because we're waiting mattresses box springs we got all kinds of stuff in there along with cool stuff so stay tuned for those so hopefully uh like i said hopefully you enjoyed the video please like share subscribe comment all that good stuff and as always we will talk to you later